pretty good stuff. Oh, we have a no terrible ah! Reggie feeds the man! <laughs> OB1 plays? Yes, right. What's up? Oh, All right. OB1 plays? going on everybody how are y'all doing we have some incredible a couple of incredible news items for you guys today and before we get started give the video a thumbs up bro all right the first news item arguably the game of last generation my the game that i of all video games I've ever played, this story was the best. Last of Us Part 2 has re um, uh, re um, received a 60 frames per second mode on the PlayStation 5. Now's the time, if you've never played this game, to go and play it if you have a PS5. And... This stays true to Sony's promise of their new, I think it's called, is it called Boost Mode or is that Xbox? Um, Boost something, where they're starting to enhance the um, form of big PlayStation 4 games so that they run more effectively and efficiently on the PlayStation 5. All right, this is officially from the developer. Then we have a couple more dope news items for this video. Once patch 1.0 for The Last of Us 2 is installed on your PS5, you'll find a toggle in the display option that allows you to choose between frame rate target of 30 frames per second or 60 frames per second. This allows you to choose your preferred frame rate to complement the rest of the enhancements that are part of the PlayStation 5 backward compatibility with PS4, such as enhanced resolution, faster load times, and more. So, faster, um, better resolution, faster load times, better frame rates. All that's coming to big blockbuster PS4 games. That, <coughs> bro, this game could have easily been a PS5 game, man. This and Ghost of Tsushima that launched at the end of the PS4 cycle. Fabulous, fabulous game. Next news item. We have another new trailer for Ratchet and Clank Rift Apart. This one is about planets and exploration. It's one minute. Let's check it out real quick. It's one minute. It's one minute. One minute. All right. Here we go. Junior's almost lunch party. Zircon Jr. Almost launch party. We have more news items after this. Planets. Course on five. Outpost L five one. Look at the lush environment, bro. This game is beautiful. Speedles. That's what those are called now. <coughs> Torrent four. Let's go. Grinding on rails. Let's go. Oh, God. Like another jungle stage. Pirate base. Blizzard Mines. Yeah, the game is gorgeous. That was it. Alright, and so. Oh, they're going to talk about the story next time. And so, as the game is approaching launch. Sony's dropping more trailers and tidbits on this game. Can't wait for June 11th. I want to beat this game. I want to platinum the game. Want me some Ratchet and Clank. All right. Next news item, bro. This has brought up some controversy, Nintendo. Nintendo just announced, they just announced it yesterday, that Skyward Sword will be launching with a Loftwing Amiibo. 
you can purchase a Loftwing Amiibo um, on the launch day of the game. But the price point is what's getting people upset. And how Nintendo is doing it. First, it's $25 for this Loftwing Amiibo. $25 for the Amiibo. I get it. The Loftwing is, is bigger. <laughs> but $25. So, the Amiibo is $25. And the Amiibo will allow you to fast travel in the game. Here's a stickler. This is what I've been heard. I haven't seen anything else talk otherwise. This will be the only Zelda Amiibo you can use in the game. So all your other Zelda Amiibo, forget it. Nintendo's forcing you to buy this Amiibo to have the ability to fast travel <laughs> in the game. How about you just let us fast travel, Nintendo, without charging us $25 to fast travel in a video game? Only Nintendo gets away with this stuff. Bro, this tweet sums it all up. This dude said, okay, so I just made was made aware that Skyward Sword Amiibo that lets you fast travel is going to be sold for $25. You know what else you can get for $25? Actually less than that. And he posts a picture of Skyward Sword on the Wii U. That's right. Skyward Sword on the Wii U is $19.99. This amiibo costs more than the entire game on the Wii U. Not even speaking to the fact that Nintendo is charging us $60 for this game. Uh, my son is charging us $70 for PS5 games, bro. The only way I would know that this game has been upgraded is if they show side-by-side -side comparisons of the Wii U version. Go and look at Demon's Souls on the PS5, that remastered. You do not need to compare it with the PS3 version. Because it's obvious the visual, the graphical enhancements that they made to that game. It just shows. I didn't mind spending $70 because I know the amount of work. And I'm not a developer, at, but... <laughs> this is a, only Nintendo can get away with this, bro. Only Nintendo can get away with charging us $60 again for the same exact game. And then $25 to fast travel. <laughs> $85. $85 for the ability to fast travel in a video game. Man. All right. Next news item. This is another big one, bro. I reported a couple days ago how this game was leaked. This was an Xbox launch exclusive that it was coming to. It was leaked that it was coming to the PS5, and now it's been confirmed. The Falconer has just been announced for the PlayStation 5 coming August 5th. August 5th, the game will be coming to the PS5. This game reminds me of a Star Fox game, but you're on a bird. That's the best way I could describe it. So, Falcon Air coming to the PlayStation 5 August 5th. I'm telling you, bro. Halo Infinite. Just make the multiplayer available on the PS5. We'll be good, bro. <laughs> Dudes are tight. All right. Last news item, bro. We beat Returnal. I might do a separate video, just my whole thoughts, review of the game in another separate video. But I just beat the game. Fantastic game. What will I be doing next? I'm going to start a platinum run for this game. We're going to try to platinum this game before Ratchet and Clank drops. Going to be on my gaming channel. Let's go get it. All right, dudes. Those are all the news items for this video. Sound off. Oh, my, my kids want to come in. All right, I'll let them in. Must be my son. He must have just woke up. Sound off in the comment section below. Hello. I want to know. But before you go. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Where is it? Here it is. Bro. Hello.
click that subscribe button. Stay up to date. All things gaming. Bro, we out. Peace. I'm going to record Saturday.